Hello everyone, it's Chloe with Zero Driven, and I'm going to show you how you can save a search. This is very beneficial when you're doing something and don't have time to go through it. So, we are going to do, or go to search for property lease nationwide using search filters. We're going to pull a list first. That's the number one step. So, I'm going to enter any location. Let's do, um... And I'm all city before. And mind you, oops, you can either choose to search around this area with a search radius or drawing a polygon. Drawing a polygon is much easier, especially when you want to pinpoint a certain area or specifically in the city center. But I'm going to do a 20 mile search radius, and as you can see, it's already found 10,000 properties within that 20 mile search radius. So I'm going to scroll down and click continue, and then it's going to let me predefine my searches. So this is beneficial to let the software know what exactly you're looking for. I'm going to look for something that's very common let's do um pre foreclosures out of state owner i'm going to continue to additional filters and i'm going to leave it at that i'm going to do at least 35 percent equity and i'm going to leave the rest you can also just dial down your search by being very specific with how many bedrooms you want or bathrooms. So as you can see, it has found 7,922 properties. So now I'm going to click. You can either click show results. I'm going to click show results. And as you can see, this is all the properties it's found. But we're going to say I don't have time to look through it. So I'm going to do save search filter. And then give this search a name. Panama. Pan. City. Beach. Um, three, four. And non owner occupied. Oops. Once you have put your name in, I'm going to click save the location and radius area selection as well. Then you're going to click save. Once you do that, I'm going to just refresh my website again and then go to my home page. And if you look, um, if you look to the right of the homepage, it's going to say run a saved search. And now you can see what searches I have saved. So there you are. You found your saved search. And once you find it, you'll just click this little eyeglass and it's going to pop everything back up and you can show the results again because it already saved everything you did before so i hope that helped some of you have a great day and i'll be back with more